Scientists have always longed to explore Mars. They believe that in the past, the red planet could have been far warmer and wetter than it is now. There may once have even been life on Mars. Tiny life forms such as bacteria could still live on the planet today. Many spacecraft have already visited Mars, and in the future, humans will too. To ensure a safe landing on another planet, engineers face the daunting task of slowing down a spacecraft, which can be travelling at 12,000 miles per hour when it enters a planet's atmosphere, to just 12 miles an hour when it touches down. They must also develop systems to protect the scientific instruments and the astronauts inside from the forces created at the point of impact. A number of successful solutions have been tried and tested, including retro rockets, jet packs, landing legs with shock absorbers, and even a cluster of airbags that softened the Mars Exploration Rover's landing. Taking inspiration from the technology used in space missions, this project challenges you to design a landing device that could protect an egg when it is dropped from a height. For this challenge, you will need the following items, and a full list is available on our website. Let's get started. To create the pyramid-shaped landing capsule that holds the egg in place, we will begin by drawing the net of a tetrahedron. First, we will fold a thin sheet of A4 card in half horizontally and draw an 11 cm long line along the fold using our ruler to make sure it is straight. Next, we will open the compass to 11 cm and position the point on one end of the 11 cm long line. Then draw an arc where the pencil meets the paper. We will then repeat this on the other side of the line so that the two arcs intersect one another. This point will form the third corner of our equilateral triangle. Now we can connect the ends of the original line with the point where the arcs intersect using our pencil and ruler. Next, we will use the compass to draw three more identical triangular faces. This time we will draw longer arcs from each of the corners of the first triangle because these will form the flaps needed to stick the net together. When we have drawn all six arcs around the central triangle, we can use our pencil and ruler to connect the points where the arcs intersect to the corners of the central triangle to make four identical equilateral triangular faces. We will leave three of the six tabs created by the compass arcs and rub the rest out, which will complete our tetrahedron net. Now we will cut the net out carefully with scissors. When the net is cut out, we can fold along the lines of the middle triangle and the outer flaps. Finally, we will draw the edges of the net together and check that they meet precisely to make a strong pyramid capsule for our egg. The shock created when our landing capsule is dropped will be absorbed by balloon airbags. To attach the airbags to the pyramid, we will make a small hole in the centre of each triangular face with a sharp pencil. Now we will inflate four balloons and tie a knot in each one. Push the knotted end through the holes and secure them in place with short lengths of sticky tape. Carefully, we will place our egg inside of the pyramid landing capsule and secure the sides of the net using the flaps and some more sticky tape. Our landing device is now ready for testing. To test the landing device, we will need to prepare an area so that any broken egg can be easily cleaned up. We will also need to find a high point to drop the landing device from that we can access safely. You may need to ask an adult for help at this stage. Now our landing area is prepared, we will drop our device. We will know if our landing device has been successful if when we open the pyramid capsule, the egg has been protected by the shock absorbers and survived the fall. Using balloons to absorb the shock of a landing is one solution to this problem. But we encourage you now to use your creativity and objects you have at home to engineer other solutions that can protect your astronaut egg. Good luck. You can find out more about the science behind shock absorbers and Mars missions, step-by-step -step instructions and a quiz to test your knowledge in our accompanying worksheet. And for more hands-on projects to try at home, visit imeki.org forward slash stem at home.